God, I think Ashish is the only show I've ever cried at. <laughs> Stage, in a good way, in a happy way. Green's a bit dark, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe if we mix that yellow in, actually, that neon yellow. I, I like love that. the glossy now. I like yeah? the glossy. Yeah. All right, cool. I wonder if there's anything we can spray. Face gloss? Yeah, face gloss. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's great working with Azamaya because she has a very unique way of coming up with concepts and coming up with ideas. My visual stimulation, I try to be quite specific about, so I don't follow tons of Instagrams and I really look outside of makeup for inspiration. I prefer doing something more narrative-led or like building a character or, you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, it is quite light and sexy this season. It's like a memory of going to an underground party. And I think it's this kind of snapshot in my head I had of this character and just this little light moment of very dust almost. <laughs> There's just something about him as a person which is so honest and pure in his work. Even though they're like fun and poppy and glittery and stuff, there's always like a kind of undercurrent of genuine sincerity there. I mean, I, do, I love Azamaya. Um, I love what she does. I think she's really visionary. He loves a bit of drama, so. <laughs> That's probably why I like coming back, yeah. Yes, yeah, so we are backstage at Ashish, Spring Summer 19. The look is a little bit more undone this year. It's kind of like a 6am post club. <laughs> Five. So the products we're using are a mix of fluoro -E MAC Chroma Cake and we're going to mix that with a bit of lip gloss. <laughs> and then the skin is wet also, mixing a bit of strobe cream with moisturiser. That's pretty much it. The energy is pretty electric back here. It's very, very packed. It's not just putting product on for the sake of product. It's always a story. It actually comes together on the runway, working all the different elements, costing, the hair, the makeup, and just create this kind of character. It's important to really listen to their vision and try and execute. Do you want to give her a um, You decide. So maybe give her orange. Okay. I think do went green. Okay, got you. Yeah, communication is key and sometimes you get to mood board stuff and sometimes you just have to turn up and work it out, but it's part of it, isn't it? MAC is like a big toolbox for a makeup artist. I've worked with them for years. You know, the texture is just as important sometimes as the colour. So to have a gel finish versus a matte finish is, can make a look. MAC is the only teams, really. You rely on people and you trust people and you know that they can carry out your vision and invaluable. <laughs> nice to have a picture of this scene in a nightclub and these girls coming past. You're kind of making out, hanging out the club, you're like popping to the beat, like being affectionate and sexy. And then at some point I think you should swap with them yeah. and then they can come here and you can go there. So the audience gets like both experiences. Okay. But we kind of do it like midway through the show. I think it's always nice to have a little bit of a mystery, like what kind of girl she is or what kind of boy she is or, or why she's there, what she's doing there. And so you kind of go away and you can make your own kind of story about it. Almost like project yourself into that story.